a hiring by the Toronto Maple Leafs. Don, where, wherever you are, we know you're listening. You never miss a show. You have to be happy. Because, one, they have Brendan Shanahan, who's an alumni of the Ontario Hockey League, running the Toronto Maple Leafs. You have Kyle Dubas coming in from the Ontario Hockey League, a former general manager of the Sault Ste. Marie Greyhounds. And now Mark Hunter, director of player personnel. This is all in response to Don's yes. rant at the end of the playoffs and then a Hockey Central at noon, subsequently the opening night no, of, of Coach's Corner. No, no shot of, of drafting uh, a Swede in the first round. <laughs> Not with, you, is that now a guaranteed? I, unless he's playing in the OHL. Or seven of them. <laughs> seven Europeans. Uh, Don, congratulations. <laughs> well, congratulations to Mark. I, I like to hire. I mean, Mark's been a lifer. Uh, played a long time in the league. He's done a great job. Uh, you surprised personnel. he would leave the London Knights? So I, a little bit, bones a runs. little bit surprised. But if you want to be an NHL general manager, why not take the chance? And and I think, uh, you know, look, I, I think it's a good move. I think Dale it's a good it a move for years both ago. sides. Dale took his shot a couple of years he, he ago. Wasn't, went back. Yeah. He wasn't on the bench in, in London, did a lot of scouting. So right now the link now is just the ownership, portion of ownership with his brother and Basil McRae, who has a, a minor, minority ownership uh, in London, now will be set to be announced as the next uh, GM in London. So good on him as well. And it'll be good to see Kyle Dubas, the analytics expert, and Mark Hunter work together to sort of work their way through, you know, evaluation. So I, I like it. I like the, it as a hire. On the surface, it looks like they're coming at it from two totally different directions. It would Is appear that, that way, but I, but I think it's a good... I think I like the combination yeah. of the two. I think you sort through the analytics. You use it as a tool. Mark is more of a gut feel type of guy. I like the combination. Reminder, Eric Carlson, the Ottawa Senators captain and a Norris Trophy winner, is going to stop by Hockey Central at noon today. And Ed Willis from the Vancouver province to talk about the Canucks' strong start and their game tonight against Dallas. Now, this, this job title is something new it's not like he's replacing anybody or someone's set to get fired although you know, we assume that there'll be changes down the road but this i think is a another example of you can only spend so much money on your players but there there is no salary cap when it comes to management team and and who you add and this is this is teams now thinking that they got to spend a lot of money and and it's unlimited now in terms of what you can do around your roster. But, but it doesn't matter how much you spend. I it's, know. It's who you hire. Well, it's who you, you know? hire. It's not, it's quality. Right. It's not quantity. See, uh, but Mac, you know what? They'll, they're going to do it. A player, per, a director of player personnel, in my opinion, is a guy that isn't, that oversees amateur scouting and oversees pro scouting. That's what typically that job means. And if he's overseeing the amateur department, and he's overseeing the pro scouting department. It's a, it's a bit of an assist. Some yeah. teams call it AGM, assistant GM. Yeah. But I, I suspect that's what his role will the, be defined the, the as. One, the one danger in all of this is that if, if you do not eventually fire people or, or alleviate certain jobs, is that you do find a lot of chefs in the kitchen. But, but they are and, replacing. And as long as, as, long as the, well, it sounds like, Mark's got the final say on a lot of things. Well, but he's a, he's he's basically taking Poulin and Lozell. Lozell was more the contract guy, so that's not really going to be Mark's area. But he's he's it's more of a Poulin yeah. replacement from what I see. A tweet coming into at Darren Millard, one R and Darren. Dale, could he be that far behind as the new coach of the Toronto Maple Leafs? We've uh, heard all about Mike Babcock. I don't think Dale's going down that path again. Yeah, that's, I, that's my sense. personal opinion. Is that he tried it? Uh, his I don't his it. heart, first and foremost, was in Washington, based on his history there as a player. And if it didn't work out there, it's highly unlikely he'll he'll try it again. But they say never say never. I think, but I, I think it's a long shot at best. And I think with Mark leaving. It's even more remote that he would leave London. 